Alright you guys, welcome back to a brand new episode of Banjo Kazooie. And if you're wondering why we're sitting right here, it's actually because we can break this gate right here, which I did not know about. Thank you, Banjo Kazooie Wiki. And this is actually how you can get the last Cheeto page, uh, not page, Cheeto um, cheat, there we go. Basically, if you knock that up there, you're then given a timer to where you have to, oh god, avoid this guy. And swim all the way down through here. I hope I'm doing this correctly. You basically just have to race the clock. Swim all the way up. I think it's up here. Yeah, it's right there. Alright, made it in time. That's totally what I meant to do. But right here is the last Cheeto. Cheat. And if you can, if you remember the first two, basically this one's the same. Uh, or not the same, but similar. As the first two. And all Gwentero says basically that uh, the book has pushed his luck. And uh, it's gonna pay, I guess. Alright, so now we actually have to go back to where we just came from. Wait, where am I? I'm like totally missing this. Wait a minute, I'm too close to the wall. Oh, it's right down there. Okay, good. I was not missing it. Alright, now if we just go back up to where we started. <clears throat> I can win you to one of the last things in the game. Now watch out for this guy because he's kind of a douche. Oh man, he almost blew up. Oh, now I wouldn't do it if he'd blown up. Alright, watch out for these things. I'm just going to use gold feathers on them. Because uh, they're kind of a pain in the ass. And uh, I know some of you guys are probably wondering why I use gold feathers. <clears throat> That's only because um, I just want to get rid of you. It's only because I need the health. I was not at max health because I had to go through there before the episode started. But now we're actually going to be going through this doorway, no door finally, and observing what's on the other side. Nice long nail pathway here. To what is this? Oh my god, I know, but you might not. Hey look, it's a picture of Tootie. Of course, it comes all the way down to a game show. Basically, Gunty is going to ask us a variety of questions for each uh, place on the game board. And uh, for each one that we get right, we have to move forward a spot. For each one that we get wrong, we move back a spot. For the most part, there are certain spots where that may change. There also is a certain order I like to take that I believe is the fastest and the easiest that I'm hopefully going to um, get on my first try. But like I said before, definitely not pro this game, so uh, don't knock me until you try this. Um, we're not going to find out where that other part is. Probably not even to this. Probably not even this episode. But now let's begin. She soon will be fat and lame. What is your sister, little sister's name? Tootie, obviously. Now, some of these I will know with ease. Some of these I may not. Do you know where you've been? No. No. <laughs> um, I think it's Grunty's layout, but it might be the swamp. Yeah, okay, that is wrong. See the picture on the screen, do you know where you've been? Oh yeah, that's uh that's the sand place, Gobi's Valley, there we go. And there's a little health piece that they put along with it. Let's be you act as a clown, which of these can't you slow down? The turning cards, rope crane propellers, spinning fan blades. I don't know what the turning cards is, so go on with that one. Uh, I need to, okay. 
That's not me to try. Which character has this annoying voice? Dumb voice, my bad. I actually, I have no idea. I'm not gonna lie. Um. I'm gonna go with. I have no idea. I just literally just took a guess. The other two, I don't remember the other two characters, so. Oh, Mad Monster Mansion. I believe. No, it's not. It's inside the Horned Hive. My bad. Basically, this is now a Joker spot. Well, if I get this right, what's in the dirty hip? I have no idea. Um, if I get this right, I did two cards. That's not right. Um, I get two cards, which allow me to skip another space, which actually comes in handy in the future. I don't know. If, can I try this again? I don't think I can actually. Yeah, no, I don't want. I don't want to do that. Not yet. Do you know where you've been? Oh, that's uh, what's you? Oh, not what's you? But the third ward, Clanko's Cavern. Uh. So we got how what's you? But Bay was an option, even though I said it and I knew it was wrong right away. I can't remember his name. He lost his gold. That was easy. Basically, this is a timed event. Oh shit! I was really hoping not to get this one. We have to uh, remember which Sotos sing those song. And repeat it quick because we don't have long. I did not mean to repeat what she said either. Popo, metal, yellow, blue, red, red. Okay. I think I got this. Am I actually get this on my first try? Pretty sure I am. This is actually much easier than I thought it was gonna be. Unlucky 13 seconds left over to. Uh, what did I do on the cover shot? Um That was just a guess. Those are there were questions like like these sort of spots. Panda stupid grungy score, what was my name at high school which is score? Um those spots like this, where um, if you talk to Gruntero's sister, then you can um, you can know the answer to them. And basically, this is a spot where if we get it wrong, then we die. Oh, that's easy. That's Mad Monster Mansion. I know it's Mad Monster Mansion this time. Bang. Um, let me think. Do we want to go this way? Um, yeah, let's go this way, actually. I don't understand which one makes the sound. Oh, really? Really? Musical goats? I don't think that's a thing. But the one that's true today. There are four lifeboats, the engine room has four cogs, the ship has three funnels. I honestly have no idea. I think it's this one? Yeah, it might, I think it was the bottom one actually. I don't think it had four lifeboats. Oh wait, it might have. The one that's true is what you seek. Five giant ice cubes live there. There are five snowmen. Ah. Uh, no, they were... I think that was said snowmen. That's in the eye of Mumbo's skull. Mumbo... Oh, something else. I didn't even read the first one, so I was looking for Jiggy. I'm just saying, do you know where you've been? I love that. It's one of my favorite ones. That's one of my favorite rhymes, because it's not like an actual rhyme. This huge to jam. What was my first boyfriend's in the eye? Oh, let's go. I really hope that's why I came over here. It's kind of like this. What thing's the highest above the ground? 
Mudhead, a turtle, or a muddy turtle. Alright, let's go. We're basically not given two cards. That we can use, um... Not really whenever. Boy, that's whenever. Is that a real question? That top answer is kind of a spoiler. Not gonna lie. Which was it from, you furry goon? Oh, Clank was Gavin. I actually almost clicked on that one. Clank was Clark. Oh, I hate these. Oh, okay, this one's not bad, actually. Well, it might be. Just make sure you take care of that guy first, just so he doesn't keep it in your way, because you will waste a lot more time on him than you may think. Yes, I am just gonna start randomly guessing. Mambo is maybe over here? Oh wow, that was a complete guess. Okay, I think I saw Kazooie right here. Feathers were right there. Okay, this is Banjo. Banjo is up here. Honeycomb is maybe in this corner? No, oh, that's a note. Is this some dealer note? Egg. Um, that's one of these two, I think. Oh, I know that this. Okay, well, I'm, I'm fine for time. Good heart word, the eagle's lame. Can you recall the stupid. Oh, that's eerie. Do you remember where you've been? I'm gonna say that like every time. Um, oh, that's a uh, Rusty. That's a. Um, oh, the second ward, though. And I would name it Treasure Trove Cove. Do you know and can you tell what's on Earth's my favorite smell? Uh, uh, all these are kind of disgusting, but... Oh, hey, let's go. I guess, like... Quite a treat. What's, what for breakfast do I eat? Um... I actually remember that one from last time I played through this. If there's... Oh, it's Mumbo's house. Mumbo's hut. I was actually drawing a blank in there for a couple minutes. Inside the... I, I feel like... I don't, it, it's kind of a head as well, so I didn't really know, like... It's kind of... Ah, oh, shit, this one blows. It's kind of confused, like, you know what I mean? Um, definitely watch your time on this one. Gold feathers are on point here. I'm not gonna have enough. That's not boy now. Alright, I'm just concentrating now. Alright, we're good. Gold feathers are definitely important here at the end. Which is why I was kind of worried when I only had seven. Let me just go back and collect that one as well. Oh, I actually cannot one with Kazooie in this part. Let me check how many pyramids take your pick. One, two, three, I think five? It's either four or five. Damn it, it was four. I have no idea. Tell me what you think if you're wise. Let's go. Okay, I actually did want to use that though. What turtle on these do I have? It's purple or something, I think. 
Oh, uh, it's not? Are you serious? I don't know. Do I sing so well? Um, I'm gonna be really pissed if I choke you. Oh, let's go. Yay! This is basically just, this is the last cutscene, or well, not one of the last cutscenes of the game. Um, Grunty tries to get away. You'll, you'll see what happens. I'm going to try and be quiet here at the end. Oh, 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 oh. 